What the hell was going on down there, Bigby? Abusing a prisoner like that. I thought you could control yourself. I was just doing my job. Oh, that's your job. Beating up people. Getting answers. I hope it was worth your time. Where the hell have you been all night, Snow? I was working on this case. After a conversation in the taxi last night, I got a call from Toad. He said his son found a body. We thought it was Faith at the time. Getting her back here wasn't easy, but hopefully we'll find something on her to help us track down the killer. I'm glad you took care of things. Thanks. Snow? What is it? Are... are you gonna be okay? I mean, uh, with all that's happened... I'll be fine. I just want to get to the bottom of this. I just feel like... What is it? I just... I feel responsible, in a way. She looked just like me. And maybe that's why she was killed. Snow, it's not your fault. But she looked just like me. That can't be a coincidence. We just have to find out who did this. And why she was glamoured to look like me. I mean, that's what it is, right? So, what's our next move? I'll figure this out. Don't worry. And what am I supposed to do? Sit around the business office twiddling my thumbs, waiting for the big bad wolf to solve all my problems? I'm the Sheriff Snow. I go out and do the dirty work to keep you all safe. And what am I here for then? I'm not going to be an errand girl for Crane anymore! I just want you to be careful. I almost lost you once I'm and... not yours to lose! I'm sorry. I know it's dangerous, but I'm not helpless. I can take care of myself. I've been doing it for centuries. TJ is waiting inside. He was so freaked out last night, he wouldn't tell us much. Even now, he just stops talking altogether after a certain point. He's pretty shaken up, though, so try not to be too... you know... Myself. Right. TJ's over there. I don't know if you want to talk to him first or after, but let me know when you're ready to see the body. I... I want to be there. Buffkin, do you have a second? Of course, Miss Snow. Okay. Okay, donc, euh, bonjour à tous. Donc, euh, nous voici euh, dans, le, dans le bureau de Monsieur Crane. Euh, apparemment, nouvelle, euh, nouveaux événements. Euh, donc, euh, Miss Snow a trouvé, enfin, c'est par l'intermédiaire du fils de crapaud qui a trouvé un corps, bah, le corps euh, de, la, de la tête de Miss euh, de Blanche-Neige. Je vous rappelle que la tête a été posée au pied de la porte de Big B. Et on a, on a retrouvé le corps. Voilà. Donc, alors, en fait, c'était pas, c'était pas Miss, euh, c'était pas Blanche Neige, c'était, ben, c'était quelqu'un d'autre qui se faisait passer pour Blanche Neige avec un trompe l'œil. Donc, je vous rappelle que tout le monde dans ce, dans Fableville a un trompe l'œil. Donc, euh, oui. Euh, donc euh, oui, euh, Blanche-Neige, bon, elle n'a pas besoin de trompe-l'œil. Elle est très bien faite comme elle est. 
Euh, euh, dans le... Mais d'autres, d'autres ont, ont un trompe-l'œil, comme dans, les, dans la fin de l'épisode 1, euh, la fameuse transformation dans le, dans le bar, le, dans le bar euh, où, euh, où on allait retrouver le bûcheron. Mon bûcheron, je crois pas qu'il ait besoin d'un trompe-l'œil. Donc voilà. C'est pour euh, éviter euh, les complications dans la vie réelle. Donc Big B, euh, je vous rappelle que c'est un loup. Le, le grand méchant loup de la du, du conte de fées. Euh, voilà. Donc euh, bon, bah, on, va, on va continuer. On va CJ. Voilà, il s'appelle CJ, Crapaud et CJ. Allez, parlez. Oh, that's enough. Mira, vanish! Cancel! No. What the hell are you doing? Don't even get started with me, Sheriff. What's going on? I saw what you did down there. Is that how you treat your prisoners? I'd be lying if I said I didn't want to give Tweedledee a good smack after what he put me through. But what you did to him was way over the bloody line. You scared the shit out of me, little boy. He saw everything! Okay, Mr. Toad. No! I'm just doing my job, Toad. Your job is to protect us. That's not what you've been doing. That's enough! Mr. Toad, I deeply regret the distress this has caused you and your son. But right now, we need to carry on with the investigation. I will be happy to speak with you about your concerns later, but you must understand how urgent this is. We need to talk to TJ. This ain't over, Big B. TJ. It's all right. Are you ready to talk to Mr. Wolf? Watch yourself, Big B. You do anything to hurt me, boy. It's okay. Just start from the beginning. Go ahead, TJ. I go swimming at night sometimes, in the river. I wasn't doing anything bad, I promise. Of course you weren't. We know you're a good kid, TJ. You're not in trouble. Just tell me what happened. I was there. Under the big blocks, and I heard noisy feet. And when I hear that, I'm supposed to go underwater and stay real still and quiet. That's right, son. Then I saw... I... I saw the lady! <laughs> it's okay, son. Take your time. The lady... fell in! But... but she didn't have her head on! I thought... I thought she was gonna pull me down too! Cause... cause she had rocks on her feet and she kept falling down in the dark parts! <laughs> Cinder blocks tied to her ankles. Is there more, TJ? Is it true? You know when people are lying? I heard you could do that. That's why you're the sheriff. Yeah, part of my job is being able to tell when people are lying. I'm really good at it. Is there something else you want to say? Please, don't be mad. What is it, TJ? I... I didn't stay under the water. What? I know I'm supposed to, but I was scared, and, and I went to the top again. I couldn't help it! I gave you very specific rules. You have to stay quiet and out of sight or bad things can happen. I told you. Leave him alone, Toad. He's my son. I've set boundaries for a reason. This is a special circumstance. Leave him alone. 
So you didn't stay underwater? I don't know if anyone saw me, but, but someone said, stop laughing. And then I was scared, and I went under for as long as I could. Wait, you heard someone? Yes. Why didn't you tell us before? Did you hear anyone laughing? No. <laughs> Were those the same words they used? Stop laughing? Try to remember exactly what they said. They said... They said... Stop laughing at me. <laughs> Sheriff, do you know whose voice it was? No! Bigby, he's frightened. Okay, TJ. I'm sorry. After I came up again, there was no one there. And I ran home, that's all. I promise. I want to go home. Okay. You can go. <laughs> Thank you, TJ. Okay, son. <laughs> Let's get you home. You did a good job, kid. Come on, then. That went about as well as I expected. You want to go look at the body now? Yeah. Come on. Oh my goodness! I almost forgot. C'est là le, le fameux puits magique où tous les mauvais sujets de Fableville vont y pourrir. Ok, bah, bah je, je vais m'arrêter là. Donc, la surprise de. Bah oui, c'est. C'est Blanche-Neige qui est là, étendue, un corps sans tête. Bon, la tête n'est pas trop loin du corps. On va découvrir sa réelle identité. Je vous dis bientôt et à la prochaine. Salut